Well, happening now, cool front gracing East Texas with its presence. We're bringing in Chief Meteorologist Brad Lozak for more on that and something that actually has nothing to do with the weather. Now, Brad, as I said at 6 o'clock, I'm so deeply grateful for your friendship these last few years. It is so hard for me to believe that this is our final newscast together. I know we said it before the break. I just cannot believe it. But through the good days and through the challenging ones, it has been an honor to share this time with you. And I've learned so much from your dedication and your professionalism over the years. You and Caleb have been with me through it all. It is safe to say I just appreciate everything you've done. And while it might be our last newscast, I know that our friendship will last a lifetime. And that's what I'm the most grateful for. So, Brad, I can't say it enough. There are no words. Thank you. Hunter, no, thank you, because you've made uh, uh, work, coming to work a great experience. And uh, again, you are a true professional in every sense of the word, as I would say, a consummate professional, too. You take your job seriously, and you're very good. <laughs> and uh, again, it, it, it's a sad moment now, but really, this is looking beyond the journey that you're going on because this is fantastic. You're going to take some East Texas with you all the way out to Southern California. I can't believe so it. So that's big time, Hunter. I can't I believe it. I know I talked to some of the civic groups and those civic groups think very highly of you and they are certainly proud of you because you grow, you're an East Texas gal. I'm an I mean, East you Texas grew up gal. Here. What can yeah. I say? Through and through. It is. So Thank we're going to miss so you. Uh, I think one of my parting shots for you, Hunter, is we've got a cold front. So I think it's fitting, right? That like exactly. we sneak in some of the best weather this summer right With here a little bow on for your top. last. That's right. Just trying to throw a little bit bow on top. So. Well, this is it, East Texas. This is my final show as your KTRE news anchor. I want to say thank you again for your phone calls, your messages, your emails. I have read every single one and I wish I could thank each of you personally. I will cherish your words forever. Now, as you have wished me well on my way out, I am confident you are going to extend that same East Texas spirit and welcoming you will take my place. And I think you might even recognize her. Starting tomorrow night, Brianna Rivers will begin her time as your KTRE anchor. Brianna has been a part of the East Texas news team since 2017. She's worked out in the field as a reporter in the Tyler area and over the last year has anchored East Texas News Weekend on Saturday nights. And she joins me here and I am just so excited to get to announce this and to get to introduce you to her and Brianna. We are so blessed to have you. It has been a joy getting to know you over the years in East Texas. I can honestly say that I have such a peace and knowing that I am leaving this job to Brianna and I know you want to say a few things so I promise I won't get weepy on you. This well time. you've helped me prepare <laughs> and I'm so grateful for that and thank you so much for your kind words again Hunter. It has been a pleasure working with you as I shared at six o'clock Hunter and I's desk were right across from each other so I'm gonna miss her just as much as y'all will miss watching her on TV and again our loss here in East Texas is definitely California's gain. They are so lucky to have you. And I also so want to go ahead and thank you all at home um, in advance for welcoming me into your homes. I know that I'm so excited to share the stories that matter most to those in Deep East Texas. I filled in for Hunter in the past and I can't put into words how excited I am to come to work every day knowing that I am officially a part of the KTRE team and that I will be welcomed into your homes every night. I'm really looking forward to it. And Hunter, you leave behind big heels to fill. <laughs> Heels, did you hear that? <laughs> Big heels to fill. Oh my goodness. Brianna. But I am excited and I feel like I'm up for the task. Oh, so you are. Thank you and I will see you all tomorrow night. Oh, we are so excited, Brianna. And truly, thank you all so much for just welcoming me. I know you're going to welcome Brianna and we are just so lucky to have the best viewers in the entire world. And on one final note, just one last thing, and I promise again, I will not get weepy. Um, I'm just so joyful to have so many by my side. Caleb, Kristen, Nyticia, Donna, Keith, the list goes on and on. Thank you so much from the very bottom of my heart. The Lord has blessed me beyond measure and it has been an honor to serve East Texas. And I know Brianna will do wonderful. And no matter if it's in California or wherever I am, you're still really, a Texas girl. I'm still a Texas girl, <laughs> and there really is no place like home. Thank you so much, everyone. I will miss you, and I love you. Have a great night, everyone.